All right. <laughs> Ready? Come on, guys. Early worm gets the worm. Another worm? Like, are they friends? This no. early bird gets the worm. Okay. <sighs> Pam, would you smell my breath? No. No. Let me smell. <sighs> Good, not great. Oh, God. Wow. Oh, I was asleep. What? No way. Those glasses are super dark. Oh, wow. Okay. All right, we need some tunes, I think. You know what? I made you a CD. You did? Mm hmm. That was nice of you. This is to play when you bring a woman back to your hotel room. Oh, very thoughtful. A little mix to set the mood. <laughs> Delightful. Pop that in. You're going to like this. Hello. My name is Dwight Schrute. If you are listening to this, you're a lucky woman Michael has seduced. Ah, to be in your shoes. What's next, you're probably wondering. Don't be scared of your night in heaven. Are you serious? You want me to play that for a woman coming to my room? Yeah, it's my practical. It, no, no, it's... that's not how it works. What is going on? What is going on? I'm so Michael is um, sick, and he wants one of us to rescue him. I'm not sick. I'm, I'm coming, sick. Michael. Oh. I'm going to save you. Don't Michael is in trouble. Coming. I do not want okay. to Okay, hold on, Michael. I am coming. I Wait there. Dwight. Michael, why don't you call your girlfriend? I don't have a girlfriend. But you said you went out with her this weekend. It was all made up. Just someone come, okay? Anyone. Anyone but Dwight. He hit the pole. It's broken, right? He can't. Oh my gosh. Oh, Dwight. Dwight. Oh! Oh, oh, oh my, my gosh. God. Is he okay? He's still driving. Dwight! You forgot your bumper! Hello? Please don't send Dwight. So I need you to do some work on the St. Andrews account. I need your urine. I need some filing done. What kind of filing? That just... Forget it, just the urine. That goes directly to the tester. Just... I need your urine. Like in a cup? Yes, in a cup. We're not animals, Dwight. For what purpose? It's none of your business. Then I refuse. Okay, all right, just... I went to an Alicia Keys concert over the weekend. And I think I may have gotten high accidentally by a girl with a lip ring. Are you serious? I need clean urine for the lady. But that's illegal. Don't think of it that way. It's like. Urine goes all over the place. You know, there's no control in it. It just... Not my cup, urine. A cup could find its way under the urine. It might be an accident. Were you forced happens. to do drugs at this no, concert? Just look, There's something wrong. Look, just... Just fill up the cup. Do you want to give Michael your urine? I want him to have all the urine he needs. You're not going to get my permission on this. I know that. Don't you think I know that? My father's name was Dwight Schrute. My grandfather's name was Dwight Schrute. His father's name? Dwight Schrute. Amish. I loved my father very much. Every morning he'd wake up at dawn and make us biscuits with gravy. When I was little, my dad and I played a lot of games together. My dad cheated a lot, but I never busted him on it. I would have, except I didn't know about it. He didn't tell me till years later, and I was shocked when I found out. Beauty. Thank you, sir. That's a lot of thank you. You're dressed exactly like the servants. Shut up. Okay, change shirts. Wait. I don't think yours will fit me. I don't care. Oh, 
wow. Yeah. Don't put my jacket on. Don't give me that. That would have been really embarrassing. Yes. Crisis averted. Okay. You seem tense. Hey, you want me to give you the chills? Okay. There's an egg on your head, and the yolk is running down. The yolk is running down. There's a knife in your back, and the blood is gushing down. Sleeping with Pam's mom, sometimes dinner. The blood is gushing down. The blood is gushing down. You know, I really would have appreciated a heads up that you were into dating mothers. I would have introduced you to mine. Hey, Dwight. Hey. You want an M&M? No, thanks. I'm stuffed. No, seriously. You should have an M&M. They're really good. Okay. Good, huh? Oh, good. Hey, I thought you weren't supposed to eat anything for a couple of hours after you've had a crown put in. They're having this new kind of quick drying bonding. So. <sighs> Sounds like a good dentist. Oh, yeah. What's his name? Crentist. Your dentist's name is Crentist. Yeah. Huh. Sounds a lot like dentist. Maybe that's why he became a dentist. Let me see your teeth. Let me see him. Let me see him. Oh. You're okay. Well, I uh, guess it's time that I turn over the keys to the famous Sebring. No, thank you. It's a corporate lease, Dwight. You've earned it. No, thanks. What? Not my style. But you said you liked it. You've always admired it. And but that was before. I'm thinking about getting something German, something with decent gas mileage. Plus, the convertible is a ridiculous choice for this climate. Take it back. No. That's my car. What did you That's my car! Yes. <sighs> I know, Dwight. I know. I know, I know. You know what? Jan called me about your little meeting. No. I know what you did. You, the I made cool. the whole thing up. It's white. Cool. The Sea Ring's cool. Oh, do you? Do you like it? How dare you? How dare you, Dwight? Don't fire me. Please. Don't. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't fire you right here on the spot. I'm excellent sales numbers. That's so good enough. I'll do anything. Anything! Please, I'll do your laundry for a month, I for a year! I have I a laundry machine. I'm sorry of anything I did. I don't know if I can trust you anymore. You can't. You can't, but I promise I'll never betray you again. Uh, what can I do, Michael? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? You can get up. What? Get up. And you can hug it out, bitch.
Hey, stranger. Don't say that. That just sounds weird, please. Sorry, I just feel like we haven't talked in a while. Well, we have nothing to talk about, Dwight. Just do your work while you still can. When you become close with someone, you develop a kind of sixth sense. You can read their moods like a book. Right now, the title of Michael's book is Something Weird is Going On, colon, What Did Jan Say? The Michael Scott Story by Michael Scott with Dwight Schrute. Uh-huh. Nice. All done. What's wrong, Michael? I got gum in my hair. You do? This just stinks. Don't touch it. Please don't touch it. You got a ton of dandruff. OK, let me be. How did you get gum in your hair? I was walking in, and I noticed something shiny under Stanley's car, and I got under to see what it was, and I messed up my hair, all for a stupid piece of tin foil. But best case scenario, you thought it was a quarter. Kill me right now. We have peanut butter in the kitchen. I don't feel like peanut butter. Give me an ice cream sandwich. Nope, not for you. It's for your hair, and it is 9 a.m. No, Dwight, not the good peanut butter. People are going to get mad. Hey, 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 this is my hair we're talking about. It smells good. Tastes good, too. Oh, don't. That's disgusting. Wow, a lot of calories. Well, just don't leave it on too long. Keep massaging, please. Oh, yeah, that's nice. No, it's okay. I will do this, Michael. Don't, don't. I will walk and stand on these coals until you award me the position of regional manager. Wow. Dwight. 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 Keep moving if you don't walk there. Uh, keep coming. Keep coming. Give me the jump. Give me the jump. I'm not going to give it to you. Uh, uh. Oh, 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 oh,